Just a quick tip, guys. Um, if you have seed starting farms like this with the dome and stuff, you have to be very careful how high your moisture content is in the soil because if it is too high, what will happen is you'll start getting mold on your sprouts. You'll start getting mold on your sprouts and stuff. So you got to be really careful how it grows. I got to add some more water to this, but um, you just got to be very, very careful how much moisture you put in them. These are these ones are pretty dry. These ones are pretty wet. So just uh, just a heads up, you know, just make sure that you watch and make sure there's not see how much moisture is on the lid there. It's actually quite a bit. You don't want too much in there because they will mold. The bottom of that one, that's all mold right there. Um, you just got to be careful, right? But anyway, I just wanted to show you. I've already got the seeds started. I just did these. These are uh, three days. Three days, that's it. And they're already that big. And all I did was just leave them on my table. This light's never on. They just grow. They just start and... Those are beets. Three days. Get your garden started now. Get ready. You know, grow your own food. You're self-sustainable if you can grow your own food and you can basically do everything on your own. You're self-sustainable. There's obviously some items and stuff that you can't get, you can't make um, from home. But uh, a good... 85 to 90 percent of all products you can do at home and vegetables is a is a great start it's it's so easy to do these seeds these seeds you can get them three for a dollar and you get 20 seeds in a package um these uh planters at dollarama in ontario are four dollars each and they come with like the little sticks to name them and they come with uh the circle ones they come with the square ones they come with a bunch of stuff for four dollars in the dome so the price is like you can't beat it right so that four dollars if you're a single person you only need one of each plant you can grow 20 different things one of each plant all right then you tr when it's the weather's nicer around uh the beginning of may you take all your plants out and you do sheep manure peat moss and dirt really good mix plant these in here and i guarantee you have the largest yield obviously if it's if it's in direct sunlight and it's there's no um obstructions but you don't obstructions is not a huge deal even if you live in an apartment building and you put a planter on your veranda you can still grow vegetables tomatoes potatoes everything you can think of everything you use on a regular basis you can plant and in, in any type of situation it doesn't matter like I've got potatoes growing in the cupboard right now because they're ready for tires. They were last year's and uh, you keep them inside and you keep them in a warm, medium, medium warm, not too warm place. And uh, they thrive and they're ready for the next season. But uh, you just got to get your seeds started this year. And so you're ready because uh, you're running out of time. And if you want to save a lot of money, grow your own vegetables grow your own vegetables and it, it's so easy so so easy literally maybe two hours worth of effort a, a season a season so the time that you start to the time that you finish maybe two hours in total on a um, like 10 by 10 planter box or you know from this to a 10 by 10 planter box and everything you know two hours is not a lot if you don't have the planter box obviously it's going to be more and if you don't have the soil and stuff it's obviously going to be more and your driving time is also but actual two hours of effort is all you put in and you have a pretty decent garden and you would be able to save a small fortune because the number one cost in everybody's life is food and you know food if you can grow it yourself check that one off then you just have to worry about you know rent utilities and a few other things but if you can get rid of one thing off of your plate then that's going to make such a huge difference except especially such a huge thing because it is it's such a huge thing um the grocery expenses you know but uh anyway if you like the video uh like share subscribe god bless